Well, hello friends. And if you're new here, welcome. So today is going to be a follow-up video on my previous video where I said not to use the in uh, headset feature for the 1080p widescreen recording feature. Um, I did have some people reach out to me and they said that they were able to turn it on using my tutorial and notice that they didn't have the black line like I do. So I went ahead and did a factory reset. Um, because I tried a few other things and nothing seemed to work. So I decided I'm going to go ahead and just do a factory reset. Now, before you go and do a factory reset, um, know that for one, it didn't fix my issue. As you can see, I have the black line. Um, two, uh, what you would need to do is make sure that you have any game saves that you want to keep saved to the cloud. And three, not all games will save to the cloud. So. For example, Walkabout Mini Golf, that game doesn't save to the cloud, so I lost all of my game save data. Um, in Real VR Fishing, which is the one I really cared about because that's the one that I play the most, um, you, you go to the wall on the uh, VR Fishing home area, uh, you got your wall there, you click on the settings and you go down and you, you can hit save. So on that one, you can save. Um, but just know that if you do a factory reset, it doesn't always fix your issue and you do lose all of your game save data. But if you ever need to do a factory reset, it's actually pretty simple. All you have to do is with your headset powered off, power it back on, holding down the uh, minus button for the volume. Yeah, hold, hold into the power button and hold the minus button at the same time. It'll have a menu pop up. As soon as that menu pops up, you can let go of the power button, but continue to hold down to the menu button and it will go down to uh, factory reset. You press your power button to select factory reset and it will reset your headset back to the same as it was when you took it out of the box. So you'll have to go through all the setup, you know, all the tutorial, setting up your guardian, all of that stuff, just like you had when you took it out of the box. But it does fix some issues. It didn't fix my issue. Um, now, I do also edit my videos before I upload them. So I can use uh, DaVinci Resolve, which is the editing software that I use. I can actually zoom in like this. And now you can see the black line is gone. Um, but if you're wanting to just use the raw video footage, then, you know, you're going to get that black line if you use the in headset settings. Now, if you use SideQuest, you still can do it with SideQuest and not get the black line. So there's a couple options there for you. So hopefully this video was helpful for you. And if it was, please give me a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe so you can see more tips and tricks like this in the future. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Bye-bye.